All right, so I am here at uh, about to go into nine round in about the next 15 minutes. And I'm super nervous because I haven't worked out for a while and I'm very prone to cramping really bad in my legs, especially around, you know, the fun areas. A little nervous, but we'll see how it goes. This is just kind of a trial thing. I think the, I got a free 10 day pass. Rochelle got that, I'm not sure if it was some sort of promotion or something they were doing, but I'm about to go in, I'll let you guys know how it goes once I'm out. I don't know if they'll let cameras in here or not, so uh, if they do, maybe next time I'll bring it in, so we'll see. What the f- Alright, so we just got back from 9 rounds, doing our first 30 minute workout, and how do you feel afterwards? Out of breath. Uh-huh. And I think my muscles hurt, but they haven't quite screamed at me yet. Yeah, I I have a lot of hurt. My my stomach and my legs hurt a lot. I'm also very hungry though, so maybe that means I burned a lot of calories. Yeah, that might work. <laughs> that, that might be how it works. So we did nine exercises. It was basically nine exercises for three minutes. And then um, there's like a 30 second rest in between but it's like you're not actually resting you're doing mountain something. climbers that's you're not like, a rest yeah you're doing like mountain climbers or or jumping or something like that and oh my gosh it was grueling the jump roping felt good cardio and all that uh the speed punching bag was awesome it kicked my butt though because i couldn't <laughs> hit the darn thing and i had spectacular swings at nothing uh the ones that were really hard were the kicks like the front kicks and then there was this one where you do jab cross and you're supposed to just like do jab cross multiple times to a punching bag and like I felt my arms got numb. I was like, I don't know if that's supposed to happen. Like I literally couldn't be like, I can't punch anymore. I, <laughs> was I can't it like, move. How far in like were you when you started losing the It was the last 30 seconds. So, okay, of, okay. Like, so you're pretty far round. in. Yeah, so okay. out of the round itself or there was something I was, oh the squat kick thing. Oh, okay. So that was the a, first one I did. Yeah, so we had a medicine yeah. ball, and you squat, and then you and kick, then you and kick eventually you I was up. like, I can't do the kicks anymore, so I'm just going <laughs> to squat. You're like two minutes in, and you don't yeah. think three minutes is a long time, but then it feels oh really long. Three minutes felt forever there, Dead. a few times. So the ones that you struggled with were like my favorite ones that I did well, and the ones that you liked, like the jump rope. I was horrible. Jump <laughs> rope was the, but the jump rope was the last one I did, so I was already really out of breath and I felt really tired and, and my uh, calves started to cramp while I was going and I was just so out of breath that I had to keep stopping and then instead of using both legs I did alternate legs and I didn't, I didn't even use an actual jump rope. I had these two little <laughs> sticks with balls on the ends like little flails with no spikes and I'm just doing that with it and then like the one on my right side was going around fine, but the left one, I was so tired at that time, it's just like going back and forth. <laughs> and it just, I probably look like an idiot. The kicks one I did fine. Uh, I used to do Taekwondo, so like the, the form that they talked about doing was not new to me. I'm like, yeah, I can do this, so that was fine. Why aren't you impressive? The, I know, right? <laughs> so good. Uh, the, the boxing part was my favorite, like doing the punches. I loved that. I got really into it. When the trainer came by with the pads and was doing the, you know, like back and forth thing, I was horrible at it. I, I it's couldn't do so that. It's so funny because again, the opposite for me. Like I felt yeah. like I was actually maybe like gonna fit in there when I actually did that because mm -hmm. she was doing that. I was like punch, punch, jab. Okay, second round, two, 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 and then she started counting down. I'm like, I got this, and it felt <laughs> really cool to actually like hit the, you know, you're hitting the trainer pads, yeah. but. It, it also, I was really trying to get into the kicks when I was kicking that okay. bag. Like yeah. I tried to like draw from the stress of the day to mm -hmm. be like, I'm just gonna kick the, but I'm too tired. It's like, <laughs> I, was, I was stressed out like five hours ago, but yeah. now I'm just like dying. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> my favorite part of the whole thing was the, the one where we're doing the, hitting the bag with the knee, because oh. I got to rest my <laughs> arms on top and just, you know, you just bring your knee into it, but your arms aren't moving. So I was just kind of like, oh. Right, right. Yeah, yeah. But um, yeah, that, that felt good. That was a nice little break. It kind of, my break but, was the speedy thing because like they, they totally understand if you're new that you're not able to get the oh, punching yeah. bag every I time. That. So that was my last one and it felt really awesome because I'm like, 
they're not gonna like yell at me for not doing anything because I just can't hit the thing. Like, well, Wah! the one trainer told me it took her a month to get the rhythm. Down. Really? And, um, I started getting the rhythm a little bit. This is the the little hanging ball thing you always see boxers do in the movies where they're like. I'm sure it was doing Rocky that. at some point. And she tried to tell me the rhythm, so you, it's like. Um, starting out, you're just alternating like one, two, one, two, but then the ball is supposed to. It's not a ball, I don't know. It's a bag. It's more like a it's red a scrotum. A, a sack. <laughs> it's a Chris, sack. A sack. <laughs> so it's supposed to. You hit it, and then it goes like one, two, three. Like you can hear it hitting the, the top. And it's like every three hits, you hit it again. I didn't really start getting a rhythm down until like maybe there was about 45 seconds left of, of the thing. And then by that time, I was like, okay, I'm kind of getting it. And then it was over and I was like, oh. So yeah. if I kept on it for a little bit, I think I'd get it. But the part that bugged me the most is my arms were so tired by that point. I couldn't keep my arms up because you're supposed to keep oh, them by your right. chin. Oh, and I'm no. like, uh, <laughs> no. Like every time you're in a fighting stance, even if you're doing kicking, you're supposed to be up like this. And I was like, <laughs> yeah, the fire stance, but you're like, no, my arms don't work anymore. My arms don't want to sit up. I don't want to. But I love how they were very encouraged. The trainers were very encouraging. Yeah, yeah, that was cool. Like, at first it was kind of intimidating because there's other people and they're like, yeah, you only get out what you put in. You work hard. And I was like, oh, I don't feel like I'm pretty much into this because I'm <laughs> yeah. dying after like five punches. Yeah, well, they and they told us and maybe it's bullshit because maybe they're trying to make us feel good about it. But they told us we did really, really well, that we put a lot of effort into it, which I felt like I did because by the end, I could like hardly breathe and I'm just like barely moving and uh, muscles were cramping and stuff. So I feel like there's a few parts I think I maybe went a little too overboard. That is the dog whining because uh, she wants attention. My last two exercises I did was the medicine ball um, crunches, which my stomach cramped so bad during that. That took your mom out. Uh, oh, that took my mom she, out. She couldn't get up for yeah, a while. My, my mom was bad. also with us and she tends to get not stomach cramps, but her muscles were super tight and they yeah. just like cramp up. And I don't really know why, but she just like, she did a couple of those exercises and she was just on the ground for the next like- It's like at least 10 minutes. 10 to 15 she minutes she, she was up. on the ground. Yeah. That one started to get to me too. The jump rope and the crunches were my worst. Ugh, my and core is sucked. terrible. I have no core strength. I don't either. <laughs> you would think carrying this gut around, my stomach would be a little stronger, but nope. Nope. Doesn't help. It's not how it works. So, do you want to keep doing it? Do you want to do it again? I do. Actually, okay, cool. Like, yeah, I do too. I feel like I could make progress in something like this. And yeah. I, 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 like, I see people around me like, oh my god, this is like what their second exercise and they're like know what they're doing and they're actually following the directions on the wall and not just like <laughs> yeah. doing the, you know, converted versions. But right. I'd love to do it again. Yeah, I, I think I could do it again. Yeah, I was telling your mom that I either wanted to do this or CrossFit and this was only 30 minutes. I had CrossFit. Um, the classes I was looking at are like 120 minutes or something like that. Yeah. Oh like, yeah, they're long. I don't think I could do it. Uh, <laughs> there's there's no right. way. Like, I mean, there's technically more breaks in between for yeah. them, but I, I like the intensity of the workout that you get. And even then, I was like taking it at my own pace. Like there was nobody yeah. screaming. Not that people do that at CrossFit. CrossFit is wonderful, but the, you know, I like when trainers are like just kind of there aside, like oh yeah, keep it up, but not like screaming in your face. Like really, that's all you're doing? Come on, you can do like well, five more think, of those. I don't the crossfit they're gonna go major pain on your okay. <laughs> you know yelling at you. is major pain the that's not the reference i want to make is it uh, full metal jacket that's what <laughs> wait major pain is the wayans guy yeah I know. I think that one. Oh. <laughs> we had that movie i think because uh, i bought it oh, okay. <laughs> so yeah i don't think they'd do that but yeah like th this 30 minutes was so grueling especially being a beginner getting to this because right. i mean i've You've done CrossFit in the past, but it's been a while. I used to weightlift a lot, but I haven't for months and just, oh my god, I am so tired after this. There's no way I'd be able to do CrossFit right now. Right, for like a hundred, yeah. But the, th the thing I also really like about it is that they, um, you get equipment 
with the actual, when you with, sign, when up, you sign yeah. up, you get the boxing gloves, you get the hand wraps, and you get a heart monitor. So it, it allows you to maintain the heart rate. That's your op- optimum heart rate for calorie burning. And they talked about progress they've seen other people make. And like, I even remember when I did CrossFit at first, I was like, oh my God, like I can't even lift a stupid bar above my head more than once. But I progressed to lifting like 35 pounds above, well, more than 35, because that was what was on the bar. And the bar yeah. itself was like 30. So I actually progressed to that point and could do one sit up. Say, sorry, not sit up. I can do, <laughs> I was like, I can do sit up. Okay. I can a lot of sit ups. I could do a pull up. One pull up, okay. One pull okay. up, one. I think I can do that now, just one, but that's it. By that's the time I was I quitting, cro- by the time I left Pittsburgh, which is where I was doing CrossFit, and um, yeah, but I really like this program. Yeah, this was fun. I think this will be a good, like, you know, if I want to do something more like CrossFit in the future, this is the, the good, like, prepare myself for that thing. You don't need to prepare yourself for CrossFit. I feel like I'm going to have to, <laughs> especially after this. I'm well, so you sure. feel, I almost feel like I had to prepare for nine round. Yeah, that's true. Because everybody was very, I mean... You got to drink a lot of water. Also, Yeah, and it also didn't help that, like, we were the only beginners there at the time. Yeah. And it helped that there was three of us. So it wasn't just me, like, with a bunch of people Power that knew numbers. what they were doing. Yeah, yeah. So, and, but my mom liked it, too. Yeah, yeah, I, th- I think she was she was into it. She so. was really into it. And I was surprised because um, I thought she was going to, I mean, she's lying on the I ground. I thought she was like, going to die. I know, but she's <laughs> lying on the ground. I'm like, nope, she's not going to do this ever again. Like, she's going to be like, Rashawn, we need to she's go to a yoga gym. We need to do a yoga gym. I'm going to be like, no. <laughs> So they gave us a, a free 10 day pass. So starting today, so we I think we're good through next week basically. <laughs> so I liked it a lot. <laughs> the, the dog's crunching on something. Uh, I'm really excited about it. I really want to do it more. So yeah, if you have a nine round in your city, because I know it's a chain, go check it out. Yeah, it's pretty cool. So um, I'll try it a few more times and we'll see how that goes. But uh, I think it's definitely this is something that's going to help for sure. So right, I feel like if you stick with it and are actually dedicated and really do, like you're not just in it half-heartedly, but you're pushing yourself, but maintaining a balance. Yeah, yeah, I know. Maintaining a balance, stopping when you feel pain or numbness, or you can't move your arm anymore, that's (laughs) a good point to stop. I have a habit of pushing too hard and then injuring myself, and then I can't do anything for a couple weeks. (laughs) St. Louis, yeah. Yeah. (laughs) Yes, yes, yes. But no, it was good. Yeah, all right. I'm glad we went. And me too. Your team. That was a really sad high five. Look at, <laughs> look at the elbow. Why? You can't. No, you're not looking at my elbow. Yeah. We did it, kind of. It Mostly. was still a week. Is there one more time. Shake. A hearty handshake. Yeah, we did. Yeah, go team. Yes. All right. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you did watch it, if you didn't watch it, you're not seeing this. So I guess that doesn't make any sense. You uh, still could in an alternate universe. Ooh, time travel, that'll be in the next video. Nope. See you next time.